Now on the 13th of May, the more than 13,000 people taking part in the Great Bristol 10K will be doing it for all sorts of reasons. Some will just be completing a personal fitness challenge, but many of the people out there on the course will, will be raising money for some fantastic causes. And that's why we're here in the horse stables, as you can see, to find out about one of those fantastic courses. So we've got Abby and Yvette who are running to raise money for the Avon Riding for the Disabled Centre. So um, how did you come about to be uh, doing the Great Bristol 10K? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were having a chat upstairs about how we could raise some funds when Kim, one of the members of our management team, <laughs> decided to put me and Yvette up for the challenge. <laughs> so you were strong-armed into it. Now, Yvette, have, have you done any sort of running before? Are you a runner? No, not naturally, no. <laughs> um, it's uh, not really something I say I enjoy, um, but it's certainly something that we're rising to the challenge and trying to get done properly. But it, it's the cause, it's the fact that you work here, you know how much money is needed that's getting you out there. So it, would you say it's a great way to raise some much needed cash? Yeah, a really good way. We've got a lot of um, supporters helping us out, everyone at the centre is getting behind us. <laughs> so how's the training going then? Because uh, for a non-runner, a 10K can seem like a long distance. How's that going? It's going all right, actually. We got up to about 8K um, a few weeks ago. We've had a little bit of a dip recently, <laughs> um, but the plan very much is to get back onto training this week and um, yeah, and get back into things. Now, Abby, you're training to be one of the RDA coaches. So um, it's not too, um, too much of a sedentary job. You must be quite fit already, so it, it can't be that hard for you to get up to a 10K distance. No, I think we do a lot of riding here and mucking out. The fields are quite hilly and far away. So well, good luck for the race, ladies. So if you have a fantastic cause, just like Yvette and Abby, that needs some much-needed cash, then get yourself signed up to the Great Bristol 10K.